Hi, my name is Matthew Pierce. I'm a software engineer, and today I'd like to show you how to create recipe, recipe templates in Microsoft Word and Microsoft Excel. Now, recipe templates, they kind of have four essential elements. Um, a name of the recipe, the ingredient list, the instructions or directions on how to create it, and sometimes a narrative that describes what it is, how many servings, um, what kind of, uh, you know, maybe it goes good with red wine or something like that, um, you know, things like that. Now, in Microsoft Word, you can get these readily available templates right off of Microsoft's website. To do that, you go into Word, say New, and you want to come up with, you want to find a recipe template. All you have to do in the search bar here is type recipe and it'll go out to Microsoft Office Online and pull down this whole list. I mean look at all these templates. You just have a wide assortment of templates that you can choose from. You can pick any one of them. It'll download it onto your system and then you have it right there. You can go through, you can edit it, you can change it, put your own graphics in, you know, tailor it to your own needs. And it's really a, it's a nice, easy starting point. And then it caches it on your system for later. If you want to do it again, it's already there. You don't have to re-download it. So Microsoft Word is very simple. Microsoft Excel is a little bit different. In that case, you have to make your own rows and columns and things like that, like I've done here. I've, I've created this column right here. It's actually, it's three columns. I've merged the cells together. Uh, when I do that, I use the merge and center function right here. You can merge and center, merge across. There's different types of merges you can do. So I do it for the name up here so that I can write it in here. I wrote bacon and eggs. And then here, this is just simply um, three columns of rows. And you can put, you know, your amount, your measure, uh, your ingredients there so you can build your ingredient list. Here, again, this is the instruction area. I have created one big cell by merging a, a large column of cells then I told it that I wanted it to be uh, to word wrap and to you know left justify start at the top to do this I'll show you how to how to create a big cell like that you just select a range of cells that you want merged into one go here you can say merge cells and then you can say word wrap right there and then now you can type some text into it and it'll word wrap for you. Now, you see, you see right here, it's, it's putting it down at the bottom. You can right click in there, go to format cells. Um, okay, that's not where I want to do. Go right click, format, here we go, alignment. Go to alignment, you can say horizontal alignment, you can tell it to justify it, and the vertical alignment, you can tell it to move it to the top, say okay, and there, that's what it did. And so I did that with, uh, this cell right or this group of cells right here and another with my little narrative thing right here so now you have the basically the start of of a template or something that you can use as a template i'm going to delete that because you don't need it um, and then what you can do is you can save this by going to save as and then you go down here you, you pick excel macro enabled template you would choose this uh, because you, perhaps you may want to do some nutritional analysis or create shopping lists. You might be doing math or macros on this. So if you save that, you can go back later and add in more nifty features to it. And then you just give it a name like I have here, recipes.xltm, and it's a template for that. And you can say save. Yeah, I've already saved it once. I'll do it again. And then later, if you want to go back, you want to say new, you can go new from my templates. And there's your template right there. You can reuse it uh, to make your own uh, recipe cards in Excel. My name is Matthew Pierce. Today we talked about how to create a recipe template in Microsoft Word and Microsoft Excel. Thanks for watching.